how you guys this is me sc and i'm back I'm back so i'm about to make a video on how i cook my seafood but since i'm upstairs i'm going to show y'all the sandals that i got from five below yesterday these are the black ones has the love with the hearts and then i got a gray pair and then we're gonna go downstairs and get started these are the gray pair Okay, so yeah, I'm about to go downstairs. I went to Walmart to get me, I think I got four potatoes. I was going to cook my uh, blue crabs this evening, but I decided not to because that's going to be like a lot of food with the, I have three king crabs. A pound of shrimp and the potatoes. So I was like, I don't need all of that, you know. So I'm gonna save my blue crabs for tomorrow. So I'm gonna get started. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna get started. I don't know why I got this charger in my pocket. I hope everything is as it should be. But I'm going to check everything out and make sure it's as it should be. And I'm going to be back. Okay, y'all. I was checking my volume and the backlight. And everything is as it should be. So, about to get started. I'm going to show y'all how I cook my seafood. Season the pot and everything. Because I know y'all want to know. And I thank y'all for all y'all love and continued support. Greatly appreciate. Yeah, I had some the yaffa balls for uh, I guess a little lunch snack and a banana and some naked juice because I was hungry and I couldn't wait. And y'all, I'm going to use my lemons tonight before they get too old. My crab's still in here. Okay, y'all, I'm back in the process of in the process of my last video. And I told y'all I was going to end it and check it and come back. Well, it ended it for me because that video never take. And my phone died. Because, you know, when you upload the video, you have to put it on never time out. So, y'all, got my battery charger in this backup. So, I am going to put my potatoes on first. Oh, uh, yeah. If I can find them. And I decided I'm going to do some. What am I going to do? I'm going to do some. Uh, I got four potatoes. Four red potatoes. Y'all know how to. Clean the potatoes off and put them in some water and boil them. So, and I'm going to boil me two eggs. Okie dokie. I wanted a bag of red potatoes, but I want the five pound bag and they ain't had it. So I just got these four. Cause they had a 10 pound bag and I don't eat them as much as I used to. And I don't want them to go to waste. So I'm gonna do that. And I'm probably gonna make my sauce in the meantime. Put me two eggs in the pot with the potatoes. This is the pot that I use to cook my seafood in. This is my mama pot. I took it from her house. But she know I got it. So she's okay. And as I was saying, I'm going to use these lemons tonight to squeeze. Because I don't want them to go to waste. So yeah. 
And I had, for a snack, I had some Yaffa Balls, the yeast Yaffa Balls, and I had a banana, and some Naked, I had a Green Machine, and I had some Mighty Mango. Because I was hungry. I was trying to go as long as I could, and I didn't surpass that. So, yeah. Now that I unthawed the seafood, here's my shrimp and my three legs. Putting too much water in this pot. Don't need a lot of water. All my stuff out for y'all. Dry this counter off so I can move my phone over here so y'all can see when I do it. Y'all, my bad. Y'all know my um, tripod is broke and I just got this one from Five Below. It ain't no good, really. Okay. Again, I'm not going to cook the blue crabs tonight. I'm going to save them for tomorrow. Because with the king crabs and the eggs, the potatoes, and the shrimp, I think that's a bit much. And I'm not going to eat it all, so it's no need for me to even go ahead and cook them tonight. I'm going to put them in the refrigerator tonight. And they'll be okay tomorrow. There's no particular order on what I add in there. And no amount, I just add what I add. Let me get myself together. Y'all, my kids act like they thief. They can't hear nothing. That TV is so bad. I don't even think I got a lemon in here. And I hope I got a lemon because if I don't, and I just came from Walmart, I'm going to be devastated. Lord Jesus, help me. Don't tell me I went to that store and didn't get no lemon. Because I'm going to be mad for real. Mad at nobody but myself. Because I was just in there. Y'all, I got one in the cabinet. I found it because I was about to get upset. So I know I only got one left, so when I go back to the store, I have to get another one. It's not open. So I take a skewer and I stick it in there. Open it. And cut my pot on. One six. This one. So that's my lemon juice. Paprika. And now I don't want to come out. The slap your mama seasoning, Cajun seasoning. Don't add too much. I'm going to put all this dash in there because it's not a lot. And I have another one in the cabinet. This about going to. This is the Tony. I'll be saying his name wrong, but y'all, Tony Cetrus. Or whatever. Some apple cider vinegar. Obe. 
today. I have the low sodium kind. Y'all know I don't like all that salt. My garlic powder. My Goya. One time I didn't use turmeric, but I'm not going to use that tonight. Onion powder. And you put how much you want. I do what I do. My parsley, I'm going to take the top off. I took the top of my Maybach. I took the top off the Maybach. The ginger. Just squirt a little bit in the pots. Y'all, I done use two of these to this one of these gingers. I think I put too much, but it'll be alright. Because, yeah. That was a bit much. That's enough. And I put some butter in here. And then that's good. That's all. It's not a lot of butter in here, so I'm going to just put it all in here. to fly around and I'm gonna put the top on the Maybach this is the Maybach I'm putting the top on the Maybach <laughs> I'm going to rinse off my shrimp and stuff I already did it once I'm gonna do it again then I'm going to I'm probably gonna make my sauce and then yeah They not even unthawed all the way yet. You never loved me when I live when you feel like that. In the spirit of me. Y'all, I'm enjoying making these videos because I know when school start back, it ain't going to be this many. It's going to be soon. So I got to get it in there. Get in there. Yeah, yeah, get in there. Y'all, I still want my Nathan's hot dogs and my chili and stuff. Tomorrow, I'm going to have crabs, so. Probably won't do the hot dogs till Friday. And why I want them, because my client been eating hot dogs for a uh, week straight. Two weeks, almost two weeks straight now. No, a week straight. Okay, the shrimp is over there. I'm gonna rinse these off. It's gonna be enough for me. Never eat it. 
And I know it ain't no good. And I had it since last week. It's a week old. It ain't no good. Anywho, as I was saying, I don't know what else I forgot. Oh, yeah. What I was saying was I wanted to put some of this stuff up. Get all the crabs tonight because the trash comes tomorrow, but whatever. Let me transfer this on the other side of the mountain. And I'll be back to get y'all, okay? Y'all still don't want none of my seafood. He had Wendy's. Okay. Y'all, this is my little candle. It was a candle. And I cleaned it out real good. I cleaned it with a Brillo pad. And this is what I'm going to put my sauce in tonight, I think. And then I'll just dip it like that. Yeah. Because I like, this is a nice thick glass. And I don't want to just throw it in the trash. And today was like, you could just clean it out. Okie dokie, let's make the sauce. Sorry. Y'all already know how I make my sauce. Don't you, baby? Don't you, baby? Um, what am I looking for? Oh, gotta get the butter out in the range. And the chicken broth. Y'all, these are the yaffa balls that I had. I, I hope that's how you say it. I don't know. Laffa, faffa, whatever. I say yaffa. I had these. They're vegan. I had, uh, how many I had? I cooked six, but I only ate three. I gave the other one to this lady. She's a vegetarian. I hope she likes some, but if not, it'll be all right. Make that sauce, baby. Y'all yeah, want to see my dark microwave? It's very nice. I love it. Y'all can see. I never seen a, a microwave dark gray like that before. Let me stop messing with this thing because it's already fragile. And y'all, I had to get the churn style country crop because they didn't have the original. I don't think it's no different in the taste, but I just like original. Anyway. Justin, how many things you got on in there? A TV and something else? Right, and that's too loud. I think this is a bit much butter. But whatever. Just be a lot of sauce. It's your fault all that talking y'all do. Y'all keep on talking to me and stuff. Oh, I forgot to cover it up. Y'all, this microwave is so quiet too. So quiet. 
Look at him still fighting. You see him? He will try. Nope. Won't get me, baby. I need you for the old me. Need you for my sanity. Need you to remind me where I'm. Can you remind me of my... You keep me down. The paper towel almost got buttery. Okay, y'all. It's not too much butter. See, ever is sweating. Dab it off. Okay, it ain't too much butter, so that's good. So... Of course, we add the ranch. Sorry, y'all. I know y'all want to see. Okay. Garlic. On your pot up. And I don't even think I'll be doing this. So let me start acting up if I be made something wrong. Okay, this is Goya Tony Saturate. I'm not adding this because this is too hot. That's enough. Where is my other Mrs. Dash? Now look at me talking all that trash. I swore I got some. Jesus. I know I got some, because I know I got some from the store the other day. I guess I didn't, because I don't see it. I usually be keep my stuff stocked up. Well, ain't going to be nothing today, because I don't see it. Anyway, while I'm in here, I guess I get the hot sauce. The pepper no prika. I hope I ain't already added this, but I don't think I did. A little ginger. This is lemon. Ginger. That's enough. Oh, bed. Garlic. Never too much, never too much, like Luther say. You could never have too much garlic powder. Never too much, never too much. A thousand kisses from you and it was enough. I just don't want to stop. Oh my love. And I can already tell me need some more ranch because it's loose. Loose as a goose. This sauce is really easy to make. You can add and take away whatever you don't like. I don't like spicy stuff, so I'm going to try to do that spice, baby. God thicken it up with the ranch. Y'all know I gotta taste it, baby. If you were from where I'm from, then you would know. And then when my pot start boiling, I add my king crabs in there and I cook everything for a total of 20 minutes. So I put my king crabs in there for 15 minutes, and around that time, I'll go ahead and add my shrimp. And I let my shrimp cook for, I let my shrimp cook for three, no longer than five minutes, because they're going to get hard. I mean, they're going to be tough, so I'm going to do three minutes for the shrimp, and that's going to be it. 
Okay. Ready to taste? Perfect though. Mm, that was a little salty on that spoon because it ain't get blended together, but yeah. Mm. Mm. <clears throat> yes, honey. Don't even miss the Mrs. Dash. I mean, I do because I know it's not in there, but the taste is good. It's very good. Let me put my stuff back up here. Because you know, if you clean up as you go, you be all right. My client told me this. She said, wash dishes while you're cooking. So when it's time to eat, you at, when it's time to eat and after eat, after you eat, you don't have to clean up. Now let me make sure, cause I know I be keeping my stuff stocked up in here. I can't believe I don't have no meat in the But I guess I don't. Oh well. It's all good in the hood. Cut my lemons up. Cause it's gonna be time to eat sooner or later. Baby, baby. But while we're here, tonight I'm gonna have pineapple Fanta. So I'm going to pour some in my glass. In my glass. And I'm going to put it in the freezer so it can get nice and frosty and slushed out, okay? No more of them little alcoholic drinks for me. I don't need that. Baby. I don't go back to the sea lady that don't drink. I know it was a heavy drinker, but I tried those and I liked them. And I found myself getting addicted to them, so I had to just, you know, fall back. Let it go. Smelling good over here. Let me bring y'all with me. See? And then this is my potatoes. And y'all know I love the pumpkin, so I have some lined up back there. Yep. And y'all know I told y'all I was getting a new living room set. I just ain't made the time to even go get it. But I'll probably do that one day upcoming. But I'm going to show y'all my pumpkins that I got from Dollar Tree while we're here. We have time, if y'all don't mind. Y'all see the Dollar Tree bags? Y'all know I love Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree and Walmart's my favorite stores. I love Dollar Tree, I love pumpkins, and I love candy. So my lip, my set that I want is like brown. It's like my brother's. So I seen these candles. That I'm going to put on my table. Because I don't have a table now in my living room. I did, but it got broke down. This is a salted caramel. And then this is a vanilla bourbon. These came from Dollar Tree. Y'all see this? Seven ounce candles. That's a good deal. Let me put it back up. Got this little pumpkin and then this red one. I got these two because I'm gonna like put them in a little order and I'm gonna put these two gold ones, like gold, copper, goldish, whatever, on each side. Y'all love these little pumpkins. I got this color. It was like so many, and I was, I wanted to get, I wanted to get them all, but I was like, no, 
got this orange it's like kind of like this but not really and i have a green one i wanted to get every color they had but i was like no that's gonna be too much and it ain't gonna really match and i have this one no it's gonna put them together some kind of way y'all see the color scheme this is like how it's like brown but the pillows has the colors in it so yeah Dollar Tree be having some nice stuff, y'all. Really do. And I was supposed to give a shout out to someone, so I'm going to get my phone and find it. And I also want to give a shout out to Tina Hopkins. Hey, girl. Thank you for watching my videos. Love you, baby. It was two in one. out of harm's way <laughs> if you know what I mean if you know what I mean baby okay the bed is boiling I was gonna show you something else but I'm gonna show y'all how I put the meat in the pot because I know y'all want to see but anyway so put it in there like such Oh, yeah, I was going to get a shot out. That's what I'm supposed to be doing. Come on now. Get on in that water now. Don't try to burn me, baby. And I got to put my timer on. Oh, fishy, fishy. Let me put my timer on right now before I be forgot. I'm put it on 19 minutes since I've been playing around for a minute, probably. Okay. Now I'm going to get to the shout out. That's what I'm probably doing. Hi, Nicole Smith. Love you, baby. Baby. Hello. Renee Patterson. And yeah, y'all. I'm going to let that cook. And put the shrimp in there. So I guess I'll be back whenever because I don't really got nothing to talk about for 15 minutes. And I need to get my setup over there together. But I can pour the sauce in here for y'all. Because I told I was going to put it in there. I hope I don't make no mess because y'all know I'm clumsy. Let me rinse this out again one more time. And I do have some dishes I need to wash, so that's what I'll probably do. Until the 15 minutes are up. Ready or not, you can't hide. Y'all, this stuff so good, you gotta get it out. Perfect. Alright, child, I'm gonna clean up my kitchen, wash my dishes, and I'll be back when it's time to put the shrimp in there, okay? Or I'll take it up. Alright, yeah. Alright, y'all, I'm back. It has been 13 minutes. The eggs and potatoes are boiling. The potatoes are not quite done yet. But I done wash my dishes up. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to 
take the lid off the pot. I'm just going to go ahead and cut my light off. And then I'm going to put the shrimp in the water and just let them get in there. And I'm going to watch them because they're going to be cooking soon fast. Even with the pot off, they'll still cook because the water is so hot. They already turning pink. Y'all can see good. And my spoons are all the way at the bottom. Let me turn this and get me a spoon. They go to calamity. I was in here sweating so hard. I don't know why my air is on everything. Went took out the trash because Zion is his trash taker, but he don't do it. See, y'all, the shrimp are already starting to get done. So, going to cover it back up so the heat can stay in. And, yeah, this about it. I wipe my face again, y'all. I don't know why I'm sweating so hard. And y'all, I just want to thank y'all for all the encouragement and everything else. The kind words that form of y'all, most of y'all give. Y'all, my eyebrows about need to be done. I was thinking, I couldn't even get no blowout because that blowout going to be gone. It's going to be called a no out. Anyway, y'all, I be getting nice comments and stuff. And how some people say I encourage them. And I just thank y'all for that because that's what I try to be. I go through stuff. And I try not to, you know, let it show. But I go through stuff as well, just like everyone else. But I try my best to, first of all, I pray to get through whatever it is. And I just leave it alone because, you know, if you're going to worry, what's the point of praying? And if you're going to pray, shouldn't worry. So just let it go. I pray a lot. I pray all the time. I got my journal and I write in my journal about the things, you know. And after I write in my journal, I feel better. And I just, you know, let it go. But yeah, like with Justin last night, when I seen him, cause yesterday morning, his his face, his eye was a little swollen, just a little bit, like a little puffy. And then when I got him yesterday evening, he went to summer camp, went to daycare until I got off work, and his face was like, you know. And I was like, we gotta take him to the emergency room. We got there at seven. We didn't get home till like two o'clock this morning. And he had to get a CT scan, all that stuff, y'all. And y'all just do not know what was going through my head. And I was just praying. So I'm not even going to worry about it. And when I went in the hallway, when he went and got his CT scan, I was like, Lord Jesus, please tell my baby, don't let, don't let it be nothing major. Let him be all right. And he was. And his face looked bad. But I think the Lord is like nothing major. And he'll be all right. So, yeah, y'all. I'm just waiting on these eggs and the potatoes, you know. I don't like my potatoes too hard, and I don't like them too mushy either because, you know, if it's too mushy and you try to break it apart, you can't dip it because it's going to fall apart. So, yeah. But I know them eggs are done, and I, I'm still, like, sweating. This 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 hair is, like, hot for real. This flow is hot. Three hours later. Get my Chinese takeout container. Put the eggs in. Because I know they done. I already know they is done. And then with Jasir, he was like, his face going to be like this forever. And I said, no, it's not. It's going to be all right. I said, you have to think positive. Because he always tell me to think positive. And, you know, believe it or not, when I don't feel good, Justin will pray for me. And I'll feel much better. I'll pray for myself, too. But he like, I'm going to pray for you. So, 
So yeah. I love my children. I might be a little hard on them, but they gotta be parented. I gotta teach them the right way. But no matter what, I love them. I gotta teach them right from wrong. And I love them right or wrong, but if they wrong, I'm gonna let them know that they're wrong. And that's what anybody I love. If you wrong, you wrong. And if I'm wrong, I want somebody to tell me. But that's like the problem sometimes, you know, people are wrong and they don't want nobody to say nothing to them. But how will you ever learn? But anywho, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me get myself together. Need you for the old me. Need you for my sanity. I want to take a walk tonight or ride my bike. I told you I said he was like, he wouldn't ride his bike too. I'm going to take this shrimp out of here. Y'all see my water? Y'all see the shrimp? They's got to be done. This is how I cook my seafood. Nothing special. Just season the rotisserie chicken. And y'all put it in the pot. This is not rotisserie chicken. Y'all know I like the joke and stuff. <laughs> it's not even chicken. So, yeah. So, whenever these potatoes get done, yeah. And, y'all, I like these things that I got with the snow crabs in them. Yes, I cleaned it out. And I'm probably going to use it again after this for tomorrow when I do my crabs. But I like these things. These little trays are, like, really nice. So whenever I take this up and put it in here, whenever the potatoes decide to get a little done. But until then, I'm going to be chilling. Probably won't my sauce because, you know, probably going to cool down a bit. Or puny eggs, yeah. So, I'll be back. And then it's going to be time to do the banger. Okay, y'all, I'm back. I'm about to uh put the stuff. Plate the stuff up in my container. I already peeled my eggs. That egg didn't want to corrupt weight, so yeah. I'm gonna take about six shrimp. And I'm gonna take the rest of them out so they won't keep cooking. So let me put this other shrimp in something so they won't keep kicking and get too hard. Tonight's not here to eat the shrimp with me. Dustin, what you listening to? Two, four, six. What are you listening to? So I guess it would be about 12 shrimp. Because I got six and six over there. And I'm going to use my tongs to get these out. And y'all know, big juices coming out of the crabs. I'm going to try to do me a good thumbnail. And like set the timer to take the picture and like that. And then have it for later. Y'all see all that juice? Where's that other leg at? Oh, it's another shrimp. So that'll be 13. Oh, 14. I'm going to take this over here then. Y'all was hiding? 15? I think it did say 13 to 15 in the bag. Okay, Sierra, let's go, girl. You playing the rain. And this is how I cook my seafood from start to finish. From start to finish. And I'm gonna get my potatoes. You know, I cook all 40s. Might eat them, might not. Get this big boy. Big boy. I 
Okay, y'all. I'm about to get my setup ready. Peace. Let me end the Let me let me end the video in the right way. Okay, y'all. So that this is me at sea, and that is how I cook my seafood boils from start to finish. How I make my sauce and a little extra talking and everything else. I love y'all, and I'll see y'all on the next video. Peace and love. My eyebrows doing whatever.